Hello and welcome back, my good little buddies. How you doing today? It's Chris here. Um, today we're going to play the New Despair, of course, on impossible mode for you guys. Um, I'm going to be using my main regular hero over here, Paragon. He's probably not the best one for this this um, this mission, but he still will will make do. What I'm going to do is I'm actually just pop my uh, my dropship in here as fast as possible just to hopefully clean up a lot of the stuff and tank a little bit of the damage. The problem is the dropships are not super speedy like in some of the other missions. They're just like regular speed, which is not awful, but could have been better. Alright, my dropship's still doing an amazing job. He's about to disappear though. Oh, there he goes. So before we die, we're going to heal up real quick. Whoop, there it is. Um, and I'm probably going to use my special ability over here to take these guys down. Especially to ties me. Um, I guess while we're at it, we'll just drop the dropship. Five extra kills, why not, dude? I'll take that damage right there. Plus, my dropship always can move around. Woo. Now, before I get too far, I'm actually going to wait to heal up. So let's just walk over where the dropship's still doing a decent job. Okay, okay. So we've got to capture only three different areas uh, and three different sets of Empyreans. If any of them ever die, well, you're screwed. So don't let them die. Or at least on Impossible. On other modes, you might be able to do just fine, but on this one, mm -mm -mm. So I'm just trying to capture them pretty fast. I'm actually just going to jump in here, use my turret, take these guys down. Take them fast, then once we have some extra units to deal with, we can obviously do a much better job. Of course, sadly, you cannot get any unit you want. You can only use um, two units right now. Uh, the, uh, what are they called? Empresses, I think? Diplomats, excuse me. The, the, the diplomats or the uh, swordmen. So let's use our swordsmen's. Swordify me. Okay. Now before we go any further, again, I'm just going to heal up. It's okay. When you're playing on Impossible, don't worry about it. Don't push through too fast. Just wait until you're healed up, and then you can go on in. Uh, you got to be a little careful. These caves can be an extremely evil joke, so don't, don't be too aggressive. I'm actually going to leave one of my uh, groups of swordsmen over here at this cave. Maybe the next cave. Let's see. Nobody comes out. No, we'll just leave him at that cave. I'm just going to kind of run in here and see what's going to happen. Let's see what's going to happen. I'm just going to use my ability really quick in the middle of like 15 guys. It looks like, oh yeah, there's the swordman up in the action. Pick him up, drop him down. Let him heal up just a little bit. While I move my swordman up, they can actually do some reasonable amount of damage again with my freaking dropship. Woo! So we got four of these guys up in here. Whoa, man. That's pretty spicy right there. All right, I think we can take these guys down. Let's heal them up. Don't let them die. Don't let them die. Um, of course, if one of them dies, it sucks. But if two of them die, you're basically screwed. Like I said, so be very, very careful with um, really intense units like these uh, caterpillar shooters. I, I don't know. The, I don't know the names of anything, dude. I really need to get up on that. Uh, looks like there is a few more enemies for us to take down. Up here. I'm just gonna grab these guys really quick. Ooh, we got these guys coming out. Let's use Paragon. They need to tank it. Alright, so now we got two groups of these guys. They can at least help us out a little bit. Pick him up really quick. Ooh, we got four sets of these guys. I just need to run away. Run away, run away, run away, run away. Oh my god, I need to wait for the dropship, dude. Four shiznit. Run, 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 run. Holy crap. Holy crap. Okay. So I think the only way to do those guys is to use my heal up while I'm attacking them. Like five of them? Oh, with these units? No way. If I had some snipers and stuff, I'd just snipe them from a distance. But with these guys, it's not going to be that easy. So I can do a little bit of damage before I end up using my actual heal. Let's see where they all at. Oh yeah, look at that. Alright, let's just use our heal up right now before we lose the game. Bam, just drop it on them, dude. Just take them freaking down. I'm not in the mood to lose. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Anyways, we do survive. We do end up killing those guys. Um, pretty beastly as well, I would say. Still got one more to grab, but let's not be too careful, man. Every single time you see a cave, you know there's gonna be some guys popping out of there. So you got to do something about them. Oh yeah, these guys aren't too bad. Those guys are though. Those guys are. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. Use your abilities. 
And we're going to heal up and just drop everybody in all at once. That's what I love about Paragon is you can just do mega damage all at once with this stuff. Just have everybody go in all at once. It's not a very common thing, by the way, to just have everybody do that. Not very many uh, heroes allow that. Okay. See, these guys aren't too bad. Um, it's, it's those guys that are the trouble. Alright, I'm relying on the dropship quite a bit to help me survive right now. Looks like once we heal up, I think we can probably just run in and actually do all the damage that we need to. Let's see. Okay, I think we're healed up enough. Plus, we got our super heal going on. Alright, let's take him down. These guys suck. Who cares about them? It's more about those nuclear guys that do the supercharge. Oh, here they are. So we're just going to take this stuff down. We're going to go for it. I'm going to use my dropship to survive. I'm going to use my uh, heal in just a second up in here. Heal it up. Destroy the cocoon. All right. Um, and I'm going to send Paragon up in here. Use my ability. Bam. All right. So even though there's like five of these guys up in here, I still think we're going to be okay. Uh, I have so many sword guys just kind of attacking all over the place. We're going to be fine. Okay. But before we go into the cocoon, we got to heal up at least a little bit. Oh, crap. One of these bad boys. Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh. Should be okay. A few more coming in hot. Looks like, again, we should be okay. How many more do I want to fight, though, before I end up uh, retreating? Oh, there's even more. Good mixture of, of stopping power right now. Do we want to destroy the cocoon right now, or do we want to wait? Let's wait. Let's wait on the cocoon destroying. You know what? Screw it. Let's go in, boys. Let's just uh, let's just go into these guys really quick. I'm going to use my heal so we can just do mega damage, and then that should be just about it after we kill like 10 of these monstrosities right here. Still a few more coming in. Looks like that could be the end. When you get this many of them, though, you just realize how freaking strong they are, you know? Excuse me. I'll dropship these guys as well. I said this guy as well. This is like plural and singular at the same time. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore, right? So, that was a little bit of a tough one for us, but if you take your time, you let yourself heal a little bit, you can even pick Paragon up at the extreme emergency situations and just drop him off in a safe location, and you're going to be pretty darn happy. Um, I would say that this is probably going to be the hardest part for sure, though, because we got to kill one of these bad boys. we got to have a diplomat, that's the good news. But the hard part is we're going to have to make sure that nobody dies. So, how do we do that? Well, first of all, we're going to use the dropship. Second of all, we're going to use our ability. Third of all, we're going to heal. So get ready to heal in just a second. Healy pie. Heal him up. Using our heal. Still a lot of guys coming in here, man. This is going to be a tough battle for sure. There's no good way around it. Just let him do the damage. Paragon, you got to survive, buddy. You got to survive, buddy. You got to survive for me. All right. Let's use our ability before he even starts killing me. Ability. Dropship as well, doing some extra damage up in here. Paragon, I can't let you die, my friend. Looks like we will end up killing this guy. Our freaking ridiculous attack power is doing mega damage, and he will end up getting defeated. Absolutely wonderful. Victory! So, that all being said, um, that was actually not as bad as I thought it was going to be. For having to fight one of those fell cocoon guys. Oh my god, dude, the, the mega cocoon guys. Those things are ridiculous. But if you guys did end up enjoy enjoying whatsoever, make sure you press that like button for me. Subscribe if you haven't. And have a super duper delicious day.